Hello, my name is Sean V. Martin, and welcome back to my playthrough of The Sims. Sorry, I just, all of a sudden I realized I didn't want to be too loud because the baby's asleep. Actually, in case you don't realize this about babies, and it seems like a lot of people don't, babies have bad eyesight and bad hearing, so not waking the baby is not usually a problem. It's seriously not. You can make a lot of noise, and the baby will not hear you or care. Alicia's finally done working. <laughs> Remember last time I just couldn't get her off the computer? I'm gonna have her go snuggle the baby and then she's going to bed. And uh, hopefully when I have Alicia back here, the real life Alicia, <laughs> back for commentary, we can give Alicia her makeover, get her tattoo, because she still wants one. She's got it right here. Alright, snuggle the baby! Does he love mommy? He looks pretty pleased. He's all yellow and sad, so I wanted to give him some love. What? Wait, what? Why is the... Wait, hold on. Can you f help him? Like, what does he need? Can you just figure it out? What? What's going on? Alright, you're going to bed. Okay, well, the, gr the baby is green now, so that's better. Oh, it, it looks like he is hungry. Well, Sean will be up in a matter of hours. He can feed the kid when he wakes up. In fact, I'll just put it right in his queue. Give him a bottle. Okay. So baby's happy. Alicia's happy. Sean's happy. Family's happy. Good night, everyone. Oh no, a rude awakening. What's up, baby? Baby's crying. Everyone's upset. I know, I know. Come on, it's the first night. You can't be that upset. You gotta get used to this. Feed the baby. Get the bottle. See, you already had it. You didn't even have to go to the fridge. Check it on your wrist or whatever. There's like the whole temperature thing. You gotta heat it up. I don't know how it works. I don't have any kids yet. Alright, he looks happy. Alicia, yes. You go right back to sleep, please. Sean is practically... Actually, yeah, he's rested, so he's got other things he can do. Right? He's doing the checklist in his head. He can clean up that mess that the cat left outside. Little jackass. Why do I even have newspaper delivery? Do I have to cancel that because I've moved to a new place? Because I canceled it... I canceled it at my old place a long time ago. And it also looks like I have mail, so let's see what's in the mailbox. It's a letter from our friends. It looks like a gift. Your newborn has just received a special new toy in the mail. Uh, do I want to learn more? Sure. When your sims have a child, sometimes their newborn will receive a special toy in the mail. When the child ages to a toddler, they can play, sing, and name their toy. All of these will improve their relationship with their special friend. So wait, I'm encouraging them to have an imag imaginary friend? As your sim begins to grow, their special friend can grow with them as well. The special toy can turn into a life-size imaginary friend that will that only the owner sim can see and interact with. This sounds insane. Do you wish other sims could interact with the imaginary friend? They can be turned real through opportunities or by creating the imaginary friend meta metamorphium potion on the Catalyst Chemistry Lab station. Okay. Sims need a good relationship with their imaginary friend to make them real, so be sure to be nice to them. I... That sounds crazy. I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I mean, I have a little while to decide. My kid is not a toddler yet. Oh, I gotta clean up the mess. Do that. Sometimes it's just nice being up at four in the morning. I wanna snuggle Jake. I wanna kiss my wife. Oh, I wanna woohoo. First time after the pregnancy. I can, I can understand that. So let's snuggle that kid, Sean. Come on. He's your son. Oh. Uh oh. Why is the baby yellow? His social aspect is low. Well, this should help, right? No! No, 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 no! Sean, I think a great idea would be to hire someone. Uh, call for services. I think uh, pretty soon Alicia's gonna head back to work, and then we're gonna need someone to stay at home and take care of her kid. So let's look into the babysitting options. I'm sorry it's so early. 
Oh, there we go. I can cancel my services. Let's do that right now. Yay! Yeah, no more of that Hector Snorg. But what I actually want to do is hire a babysitter. Oh, Podolunk. Zos. Um, Exologist. Babysitter. $75. Can I make sure that they, like, come all the time? Uh, Pleeg. Pleeg. Uh, Brindle Flower. Gundine. Okay. I guess they're coming over right now. Is there a way I can just, like, make sure that they come here all the, any time that I need them? Do I have to call them every time? I'm making pancakes. Alicia is starving. She will be thrilled to wake up at 7 o'clock and have some pancakes waiting for her. Oh, here's my babysitter. Brian Byers. He's going to go ahead and take care of everything the baby needs. Also, it's kind of weird that he's in Alicia's bedroom while she's asleep, but whatever. It's also kind of weird that he has a ponytail. Creeper. All right, we got some pancakes. I can call the household. I wonder if the babysitter will eat some. Oh, he's already about to grab a plate. I was just going to do that. Is Alicia on her way? Mm. Is she? <laughs> no, oh, there. Okay, she's on her way. I didn't have to cancel that. And Jake is being carried. Okay, can can I talk to this guy? I want to ask him if he can come every day. Teach. Joke about children. Invite. Fire. Dismiss. <laughs> oh, teach. I can teach him that damn song. I'm having a photo. Okay, not cool, dude. I have you over to babysit my kids, and you're all like, Ah, now you're sneezing on me? Not cool, dude. Brian has to go soon. He's supposed to be somewhere else. Okay. Master cooking skill. Sean wants to master the cooking skill. Alicia should want to master the cooking skill. So why is Brian leaving? I I called him over so I could have a babysitter. So Alicia could like... Oh, I hear someone at the mailbox. So Alicia could take it easy. Ah, <sighs> bills. What's Sean doing? Sean is... Sean's... Sean went back to sleep? What in the world? Okay. That's fine. Holy crap! What? Seriously? Alicia already wants to have another kid. Look at this. I'm putting it in the wishes. I mean, why not? Sean, what are you doing? I... <laughs> I'm apparently about to be complimented. My wife is so sweet to me. She's like, I love the way you look in that orange t-shirt that you've worn every day since we've met. And I'm like, it's nice, right? It fits me. It's the right sleeve length and everything. Oh, <laughs> oh that actually was kind of adorable. <laughs> All right, carpool is here, but that doesn't mean I actually want to take it. I have my own damn car anyway. Um, so, got to say goodbye to Alicia. I was making out with her. Seriously. I want to pay the bills, and then I'm going to take my own car to work. Thank you very much. Work! Business as usual. I never did that B-roll that I had to film, did I? Maybe I could take care of that today, since I'm not having a kid or anything. You know what else I didn't do? I never finished that painting, which was probably about two seconds away from being complete. It's quite possible. Is Alicia doing the laundry? What's she doing over there? Also, what's Brian doing? I thought he had to leave. Yeah, I know, but I'm not gonna take that car. Also, who's... Why are there two cars here? I'm gonna take my car. Whoa, there's that creepy ice cream truck. Okay, so now what's Alicia doing? She's watching TV. You should watch the cooking channel, Alicia. You're still quite a bit away from where you need to be for your job. Is that the cooking channel that you're watching? Cooking cable. That's what you should be watching. There you go. And how many more points? She needs one. She's one full skill point away from being where she needs to be. And then she'll head back to job. Oh my God, she's gonna get a promotion as soon as she goes back. Sweet. Right now she's an ingredient taster. I wonder what her promotion will be. So she's happy. Sean's happy. Baby's happy, a little bit hungry. Brian, are you gonna get on that before you leave or what? You're thinking about stealing my guitar? Is that what you're doing? All right, I hear the cries of a child. What do you want, Jakey? You hungry? 
You want your mama? Look, she has changed back to her default wardrobe. This is what we are used to seeing Alicia Pez in, not that purple shirt. Although I have a feeling once Alicia Pez, the real Alicia Pez gets her hands on her, this outfit is gonna change. She also wants to get rid of her glasses, she told me. <laughs> no more of that. Can I snuggle? Snuggle them. Snuggle your son. Oh, I bet he smells so good. Sean is so awesome at his job that um, as he left today, he got an extra 45 simoleon rays per hour, which means he is making well over 2,000 simoleons a day, which is awesome, and it means that he should stop what he's doing. Stop, right there. <laughs> In the name of love. Uh, I want to take a look at the map and uh, consider which venue I can make my third. I own two venues fully. One is the Corsican Bistro, which is where my wife works. I own that. And then I also own the V's Knees, which I renamed. It is the uh, theater, the film theater in the neighborhood. But I could own a third venue. And I just have to decide which one I want to own. Can I own the bookstore? Here's the bookstore. Yes, I can. Become a partner. Hold on a second. Let me head back to the film studio where I work. Which road is it down? It's, uh... I always lose it. Is this it? This is it. Okay, I can't buy that. Too bad. Why can't I buy a film studio? Um... So yeah, I think I want to buy the bookstore. That's going to be my next purchase. And what is that symbol right there? Oh, does that just mean I have a friend who lives there? Is that what that little purple thing is? I don't know what that means. Okay, well anyway, bookstore. I want to become a partner, first of all. So, Sean, get there. You can get back in your car now. <laughs> your invisible car. He's Wonder Woman. Wow! Man, it's fun when it doesn't have a texture. Okay. Okay, become a partner, and then, as soon as you come out, let's see how much the whole thing costs. I've got 30,000 simoleons. And in fact, I really should stop at my other venues and make sure that I've picked up any revenue that I'm owed. I might have even more money than that. Yes, okay, I'm a partner, that's cool. And buy out 20,000, and that'll do it. Go buy it, Sean. His lifetime achievement, or whatever, his lifetime happiness points are about to go through the roof. Alicia's too, because I think she has the same dream. Yep, she does. There we go. Sean is now the owner of Always Studious Bookstore and has full control of the place, which means I'm going to rename it. So I've got the V's Knees is my film, is my movie theater. This is going to be called um, the V's Reads. <laughs> awesome. The V's Reads. There we go. Now let's just uh, head back to the map, see if we can pick up some cash here. Uh, collect money, yes, right there, and here. Do I have any? Attend, attend, attend. Doesn't look like it. Cameo in play. Come back between nine and six on any day. What is this one? Deliver falafel. Well, oh, I have to go to Egypt for that. No, I can't do that. So Alicia got hers, sweet, and she's very happy. Her total points now over 20,000. Sean, Wants to buy a new sculpture, at least, sure, why not? And his total, now over 57,000. Fantastic. And then he's going home after that. I hope he is. There we go, now he's going home. All right, Alicia, what are you doing? Still working on your cooking skill? Okay, she's not even halfway. I guess uh, watching TV is not the fastest way to do this. Probably not. What does Jake need? He needs a diaper change. Alicia, go to your son. Hold. No, I want to do, like, the whole thing. I gotta... You gotta change his diaper. There we go. Change dirty diaper. Get on upstairs. It's a dirty job, but you gotta do it. Sean will, uh... I guess get leftovers out. I can't actually get leftovers out for Alicia, so she's gonna have to get around. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Clean that up. 
then get the leftovers. Spaghetti. And you too. Spaghetti. Is he okay now? He's green, green and happy. No energy, he's ready to go to sleep. Which he probably will momentarily. Dinner time for the Martins. She said, I just got that stuff out of the dryer. You left it in there for three days. He's like, I'm busy being a badass at work, sorry. I just got a raise. What did you do, have a baby? whoop de doo Well, look at that, I was wrong. Sean actually did finish his painting. It's even worth 34 simoleons. I can't tell what it is. It kind of looks like a cutting board, a cheese grater, and something. I don't know. As a way to boost her cooking skill, I'm gonna send Alicia out into the wide world to go get a book. This will be her first trip out of the house since she delivered Jake. And boy, is she in a hurry to get out of here. She's like, I can't wait to get away from this freaking kid. Oh, look at that. Sean is playing chess on the computer and he just improved his logic skill to five. Sean can now tutor young children to help them improve their school performance. Well, that that's awesome. I mean, that's just convenient. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All that stuff I already took care of. All right. Alicia took my car to work. Also, why is there a drummer out here? And a guitar player. Is that Dudley? That is Dudley! Holy crap, I haven't seen him for ages. Careful, Alicia, he might hit on you. I just got photographed going into that bookstore. Ridiculous. All right, I want some recipes. I guess uh, she's rank, what, like six? So can I do this? Current skill level six. So that requires five, that requires five, six. Here we go, cobbler requires six, so let's get that. Wow, these are expensive. Um, that one requires seven. I might as well buy one that's seven, and this one requires five. Geez, that's an expensive book list. Fine, whatever. Thank you, thank you. Take cell phone photo. Who, this guy? Tay Bayless? He's more famous than she is. Why does he want my picture? Because I'm a girl. What? Wait, who are you reacting to? Who's here? Just take your photo and let's get out of here. Come on. Oh, she's taking his photo. Well, that's just kind of funny. Can we at least introduce you so that this isn't completely awkward? Come on, say hi. He doesn't even want to meet? What's going on? There we go. Come on, come on. Say hi. I'm Alicia Pez. I will be a famous cook one day. Do I have to introduce him somehow? Let me see what he is. Why in the world does she know who he is? Well, I'm a thing. Oh. What is he? He's unemployed. Okay. Well, that makes sense why he's famous. I don't get it. So at least she's got some new books she can read. She's gonna read fried peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Sean is upstairs taking care of the youngin. Giving him a bottle. Yeah, he's a crying baby. That's what he does. Here comes the train. Happier? Better? His social is way down there. It moves so quickly. Here, let's play with him a little bit. You like daddy's sunglasses? He doesn't take them off inside because he likes walking into things. Daddy's a silly man. Alicia is a speed reader. Look at that. She's been reading for like 30 seconds. She's already halfway done with this book. I mean, it is just a recipe she's reading. So I guess like that probably wouldn't take very long to read. At least I hope it wouldn't. Sean, are you going to bed? What are you doing? You're just walking around with your kid? That's cool. Kid is looking good. Looking very happy. He's gonna need a diaper change in the middle of the night again. Alicia cool. just learned how to make fried peanut butter and Oh, it's fried peanut butter and banana. Did I say jelly earlier? I think I did. All right, Alicia, you feel free to go to bed. That's fine. Hold on, upstairs, and then there we go. Sleep. And Sean, what are you doing? Computer games, why don't you just, I think you should, no, 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 that is a bad, 
use of your time at two o'clock in the morning. Take care of like hygiene and go to sleep. And then maybe you'll wake up at the same time as your wife tomorrow for once instead of four in the morning. And a little wake up in the middle of the night to take care of the kid means that, no, they're not getting up at the same time. But close. Alicia will be up in two hours <laughs> or so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You like him now. You didn't like him when he woke you up because he, well, you know what he did. Dirty diaper situation. Oh, his social is so low. How about you give him a bottle? Give him a bottle. No interactions available. Why does it keep doing that? Oh, because I'm clicking on the wrong person right now. There we go. Give him a bottle. Oh, I think he was about to do that anyway. Yeah, he was already doing that. So you got that part under control. And then play with him a little bit. Oh, he's... Oh, I'm the one that's hungry. Man, this is confusing. I keep looking at the moodlets, expecting one thing, and then I see his, and then I'm like, no, it's the baby, and it's not the baby. I got it now. All right. You're a good dad. You can put your son down. Go get some uh, leftover pancakes, I believe we have in the fridge. Yep, apple pancakes. And Alicia has a strong desire to try out her new recipe. Prepare fried peanut butter and banana sandwich. I think I'll have her do that today. Lucky girl. And then she's got a bunch more books to read. After she wakes up, she will get to learn more recipes. Hopefully, we can get her all the way. That didn't really add much to her development, did it? Maybe you can only earn that by watching TV or by actually cooking. Maybe the books don't actually contribute to your skill level. I don't know. I'm not sure. Oh, she's up. She's up. Alicia, come on down and are you hungry? Yes, you are. All right. Make a... Wait. Can I... Shoot. I can't make that for breakfast, can I? Quick meal? No. I have to wait till lunch. Damn it. Well, that sucks. Well, what do you want to do? Make the bed. I like that. Attention to detail. Not a slob. You've got some books you could read. Do you want to read a book? Oh, she's already doing it. She's reading Zombies, Zombies. Oh, you know what? That recipe that I read was not one of the ones that I bought last night. I'm just silly and didn't notice. Cheesesteak is the lowest one. Oh, I've already read it. When did I read it? Does that mean I bought one that I'd already read? That sucks. Maybe you can only gain skill points when you're reading a recipe that's on your level. Now this is not the skill point bar, this is just the book complete bar. Sean, what are you up to? You are also thinking about reading? You are reading anything. Instead of just reading anything, how about you uh, come up here. First of all, I'm gonna pull your uh, I'm gonna pull your painting off the easel here. We'll make it the first painting in your kid's room. Ta-da! And uh, we'll have you start something new. You want to, one of your desires is to paint something worth 150 simoleons. I think you can do that, but you're gonna have to paint, paint something pretty big, first of all. So let's do that. Yeah, stop reading your book. And uh, let's make this a good one, okay? This this one's gonna be this one's gonna count. All right, I like I like the start. Alicia just learned how to make cobbler, delish. All the knowledge is yours. Does your son need anything? He's gonna go to the bathroom any second now. He's also asleep. Oh, babies are so fun. Eat leftover spaghetti. Why would you want to do that when you could? Hold on. Yes. Yes. Fried peanut butter and banana sandwich. Let's prove that you have mastered this very complicated recipe. Step one, you slice up your banana. Chop, chop, chop. Make sure you leave the skin on. Because that's the way you like to eat it. Make sure you chop a little bit of the top of your finger into the sandwich as well. Add a little bit extra protein. And then uh, crunchy or smooth peanut butter, I guess, is the, the other important question. I'm kind of a smooth peanut butter guy. I do like peanuts. I used to not like nuts, but I got over that. But still, crunchy peanuts, probably not my thing. 
All right, now you're gonna take your sandwich. You're gonna head over to the bathroom. Wait, sorry. There's a mirror in the way. A little too close for comfort there. All right, and then you flip the flip. How's it looking? Is it what you wanted? I hope it doesn't come out, come out horrifying. She's not like gasping about it or anything. So it must be according to plan. Eh? Eh? Nice! She's really working on improving that cooking skill. I'm going to make her the best chef in the world. And how are the results, my lovely wife? Nom nom noms? You made a good sandwich? Awesome.